A local church is under fire for offering a class on radical Islam. Many say that lesson is just adding fuel to the fire in the fight over faith. New at 10, Catherine Varnum shows us how a local mosque is speaking up about this class. This fire went up. It's the video that has some Muslims worried. The burning of a Quran. A church in Gainesville is planning it for September 11th. It also has signs in its front yard attacking the religion. And now a church in Jacksonville says it's trying to warn people about the dangers of radical Islam. Radical Islam is really dividing our nation. Pastor Jerry Fitch brought in the author of this book, Muslim Mafia, saying he wants to educate the community. We weren't attacking anyone, you know, any faith or anything of that nature. Again, we were just educating people. The structure is very, it's concrete. But Muhammad Mansouri with the Islamic Center disagrees. He says the religion has become an unnecessary target. When you have a keynote speaker and who has a long history of hate mongering and, and then you say that you're trying to educate people, you know, uh, there's a conflict right there. It's a conflict he feels is escalating right here in Jacksonville. You'll remember someone set off a pipe bomb at the Islamic Center earlier this year. The person responsible still hasn't been caught. They don't have any new leads and they're still investigating. Mansouri says with all the attacks on the religion, getting a lead in the case is tough. But other faith groups have shown support. This church across the street posted some of the reward money for information on the pipe bombing. And as for a lesson on the Quran, anybody who have any questions about Islam and Muslims, you know, come and talk to us. That was Catherine Varnum reporting. There is a $20,000 reward for information leading to the arrest of whoever set off that pipe bomb as, at the Islamic.